Forgiveness is a merciful attitude. Offending others and being offended by others would naturally lead to the subject of forgiveness. Therefore, the question of Peter is commendable. How often should I forgive? Peter wants to know how many times he must take the initiative in bringing about complete reconciliation. Peter tries to suggest his own answer seven times. The answer seems very kind, generous and charitable. However, it was limited. Instead of seven, Jesus answers seventy times seven. This answer might have shocked the disciples. The idea was then in practice that one who pleads forgiveness from neighbor must not do so more than three times. Jesus by seventy times seven meant that forgiveness should never be a matter of calculation. Forgiveness cannot be considered as a product that could be weighed, measured and counted. Therefore, forgiveness cannot be distributed little by little up to a certain limit when further distribution is no more possible. The spirit of genuine forgiveness has no boundaries. Forgiveness is qualitative, not quantitative. Lord, I know. Forgiveness is never easy. It is hard. Give me the grace to forgive always without ever stopping.